A Facebook pixel is an analytic tool that allows you to measure what people are doing essentially when they come to your website, whether that's unique page views or whether they go to your checkout and they don't buy, um, whether they actually do have a confirmation purchase. All those measurement tools can actually be tracked by a Facebook pixel. So let's take a look at how to integrate that into your Kajabi site. Just a reminder to check out reviewonlinecourse.com. It's a collection of all my software reviews, the pros, the cons of each platform to help you decide which one's right for you. And just remember, if you decide to use any of my links to trial a platform like Kajabi, Think Ethic, or Teachable, and so on, you get a free pair of Apple AirPods as my way of saying thank you. Check the description box below for more details. Anyways, back to the video. Okay, before we dive into actually how to integrate a Facebook pixel on a Kajabi website, let's first talk about what exactly a Facebook pixel is, right? So some of the pixel events you can expect is a page view. That's just when someone lands on your page and takes a look at what you got going on. It's kind of like browsing, but on the internet. Then there's a lead. Well, a lead is essentially a prospect. It's um, someone who's interested in what you're offering. Like it's called an ethical bribe. You can create an opt-in form and you can actually give a gift, maybe something digital or maybe a PDF or something like that in exchange for a phone number, an address or an email address. And that person through an indoctrination process can actually become a customer. Uh, initiating checkout, someone who's like really excited about what you have to offer, they go all the way to the checkout and then they leave. Or maybe they actually even go ahead and become a customer and they go beyond and they make a purchase. Facebook pixels will track all of the behaviors of any users that come to your website, which is phenomenal. That way you don't have to sit there and try to watch that. It does it all for you. So just wanted to actually talk a little bit about what a Facebook pixel is and how now let's check a look at, let's check on how to integrate that into your Kajabi site. Okay, we're back here at the Kajabi homepage. You will find it under settings, not anywhere in here. This is how you actually build out websites and pages and opt-in forms. Go to settings. You'll see third-party integrations. Click on that, scroll down, and you will see Facebook Pixel. Toggle that on and then place your Pixel ID and your access token right in this. Now, if you don't know how to do that, you can click on these buttons and they will tell you. I will just give you a, a, quick, a quick little like summary of exactly how to do that because Facebook is always changing it. So by the time I make this video, there's probably a new way to do it. But essentially, you want to come to uh, business.facebook.com. And if you, if you go here and you go to business settings, that's where you want to be. You don't want to be an ad manager or events manager. Just go to business settings, click on business settings. From here, you'll scroll down, data sources, pixels. Click this ad. You can name it and it will generate a pixel for you. And you'll get those numbers. You get that pixel ID number and you'll get that access token number. And when you get those, you come back over to Kajabi and you place those in there and you're done. Gone are the days where you have to actually put the Facebook pixel on every single page. I remember those days and I don't miss them at all. So now you can just put it in here and toggle that on, hit the save button down at the bottom and you're done. That's how easy it is. I hope you enjoyed that. I will see you in the next video. If you have any comments or questions, make sure you put them down below.